Today on AWI Woodworking, I'll be showing you how to use resin and make your own pin blanks. Alright, so here I have a pair of scissors, some clear tape, some plexiglass, sawdust, and some two-part clear resin. You can pick this up at your hobby store for $20 or under. Alright, so we're going to be taking our pair of scissors, our clear tape, plexiglass, and we're going to be cutting this down to the shape that we need it. I have a pen blank and just made out of wood and we're going to be making our own mold with the plexiglass to where we can pour our resin and our sawdust into. Alright, so I have the plexiglass and here's our pen blanks I was talking about. So these are the sizes that we'll want our resin blanks to be. So we're just going to take the wood pieces and lay them on here on the plexiglass. Take our scissors and come up about the same size as the wood blank, a little more, which should be about right there. And then we're going to cut across and make and make little segments of the plexiglass that can go across the sides. Now it needs to be chopped down a little more, about right there. And you'll want to do this to go around all your sides of your pen blank, including this side, that side, and these two. We'll wrap tape around them, and then that will give us something to pour resin into. So let's get started by cutting out these plexiglass pieces. All right, so I have my A side, our B side of the resin, a party cup, a half cup measuring cup, our sawdust, and here's our two plastic molds I made. They turned out fairly well. I made them out of a plexiglass, and I made two of them. I automatically use the two separate ones because then I don't have to cut them on my chop saw afterwards. Saves them time and possibly a finger. So, uh, um. We're going to start by mixing this stuff up, so let's start by pouring our A, then B side in there, pour into our party cup, and then mix in our sawdust, and then pour into our molds.
All right, so I we poured the resin and mixed with our sawdust into here, and I think these molds are going to do a good job. And we're going to set these up and let them cure. All right, so it's been about 24 hours since we mixed up our resin and poured it into our blanks. But it actually takes two to three, even up to five days for this resin to fully cure. So I went ahead and after 24 hours took the Puxy glass. I actually had to use a chisel to get it off there. Um, and now I got it off of the resin blanks. And as you can see here, I think they turned out fairly well. We're going to go ahead and take these over to our bandsaw and cut the wood off on the bottom of these blanks. Well, we cut the bottom of the pit blanks off, and I think they all turned out fairly well. Well, I hope this video has been helpful, so now you can go use resin and make your own pit blanks. Thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next one.